So look at this. Look at this starting menu now. She's pumping out on Pappy Roo's head. Pappy Roo ain't even mad. He's he's all for it. He's like, yes. Now everyone will see how glorious my new hat is. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, Undyne is the best hat. And continue. Yeah, yeah. That was oh, me god. syncing up my audio. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right. So when we left off, we were about to go into the laboratory. We were gonna go in the laboratory. Um, I think one of these is a girl. I I never really was able to tell. <laughs> Like, I couldn't tell I'm you. I'm pretty sure this one is girl, because it's like, like, it told us. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us there was totally a human in the area. So, like, as royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now, and I totally botched that whole sentence, but yeah. Even if the elevators aren't working anymore, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. Undyne. This right. is hard voice work. <laughs> this is a lot. Alright, fucking, why am I doing this? Nope, <laughs> Talks to one person, saves. <laughs> we this don't game know. fucks you up. The spotlight is mine. Oh, it's a spotlight? Oh, okay. I thought Frisk was just bioluminescent. We don't know what the child's been touching. We don't know if bicycles are radioactive. It me. It's it you? you. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, God, it's a plug. Oh, wait. It's me. Same thing. Oh, it's too dark to That's look at the trash can. a trash can. It's too dark to see the trash can. Here, I'll voice the big lizard. Alfie's? Mm-hmm. Such buck to- Oh, it's bright! And at last I see the light. Oh. Oh, my god. I, I had a perfect voice, I forgot Come on, already. nerdy, nerdy. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, it's it's all messy and... Uh, uh. <laughs> Did she just have a panic attack? Yeah. Oh, I bet um, she'd fall down like she uh, uh, Hiya, I'm Dr. Alphys, I'm Asgore's royal scientist, yeah. but... but uh, I, I'm not one of the bad guys, quote-unquote. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've um been observing your journey through my console. <laughs> Your fights, your friendships, everything. We don't fight. We love. We love. Frisk is, we hug Frisk the is nothing if not a prodigious lover. I just want to love. <laughs> can we replace fight with hug? Like, can you gotta, we just. <laughs> you gotta keep do the same, like, action, but it's like hug. <laughs> yes, like the perfect hugging angle. The critical like, hug. Like if you hug like t at the far ends on accident, you can do like a really awkward hug where like the arms don't line up right and it's just really uncomfortable. Like like <laughs> fighting is a randomized motion between like hug, high five, and like <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Um, like you you're trying to <laughs> high five, but you critically miss, so you do like a hand turkey with the person. Oh, oh that's really awkward. <laughs> <laughs> no. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. So, so uh, now I want to help you. You know those cameras that we're finding along the way? Yes. Why is she sweating? Because she's really uncomfortable. Uh-huh. That's not the face of uncomfortableness. She kind of really wants my butt. I... Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through the hotlands. I, I, I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Mm. Well... Actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Definitely not a weird, kinky porn star. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You yeah. know, <laughs> just some small practical adjustments. Like, um... Anti-anti-human combat features. Uh, of course, uh, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided uh, I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but um, hopefully, we won't run into him.
a blammo, I assume? Yeah, there's like a dinging sound. That... Did you hear something? When the room shakes, there should not be a dinging sound. I don't mean like a ding, I mean like metal clanging sound. Oh no. Isn't I forgot the field? voice <laughs> already. It was high pitched nerdy. Is this is this medicine? That's medicine. Oh yes! I'm I'm turned on, there it is. Welcome beauties! <laughs> oh yes, there it is. That's definitely Metaton. <laughs> To today's quiz show! Yay. Oh boy! I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant! I hate this. Never played before, gorgeous? Thank you, I am gorgeous. No problem! It's simple! There's only one rule! Answer correctly! Or you die! Alright, sick. <laughs> she looks like she's trying to, like, escape from the mouse. <laughs> Eesh, there's a mouse! <laughs> cry? That's my option. <laughs> why Why cry? Check. Metaton, 10 attack, 999 defense. His metal, blah, 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 blah. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. I see. Let's start with an easy one! You have to cry on him to make him rest. What's the prize for answering correctly? Look at her hand, she's telling us what letter it is. E? Right! <laughs> Sounds like you get it! The quiz show continues. Just cry. <laughs> Screaming is against the rules. Here's your terrific prize! What's the king's full name? Asgore Dreamer. Yeah. Fuzzy Correct. pushover. What Dr. a terrific <laughs> The quiz show continues. No, I don't want to do this. Fucking shift, that's the back key. Mercy. Enough about you. Let's talk about me! God bless you. What are robots made of? Science and magic. Metal and magic. Close enough. Too easy for you, huh? The quiz show continues. Here's another easy one for you. Thanks, Metaton. Two trains. Train A and B simultaneously depart train station A and B. Train no. station A and station... Oh, wonderful! <laughs> I am astounded, folks! <laughs> no. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? A. <laughs> Correct! You're so lucky today! <laughs> Let's play memory game! What monster is this? That's a frogget. Nope, it's Metaton. I'm so <laughs> flattered you remembered! <laughs> Bullshit. I know! But can you get this one? Would you smooch a Heck ghost? Heck yeah! Great answer! I love it! <laughs> Here's a simple one. How many letters in the name Meditan? Now they're U's. Now they're U's. Of course, that was easy for you. The question continues. Time to break out the big guns. Oh yeah. In the dating simulation video game Mew Mew Miss Kissy Cutie, what is Mew Mew's favorite food? And then and then there's probably ice cream for all of her friends, but it's a snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. And then again the favorite parts of the game because it actually is a really powerful message about friendship and <laughs> Alfies, Alfies, Alfies! You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh you should have told me. I'll ask a question you'll be sure to know the answer to. <sighs> who does Dr. Alfies have a crush on? All of these are correct. Which one do you want me to pick? Obviously, Undyne. That is the OTP. That is the OTP. But if I... The human one's pretty funny, though. Yeah, well, what about Asgore? Yeah, Asgore. I will do Undyne. It's the true OTP. See, Alfies? I told you it was obvious. <laughs> Even the human figured it out. Gay. Yeah, she scrawls her name in the margins of her notes. Disgusting. She names programming variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. She writes fan fictions. 
Sharing the domestic life. Ugh, domestic fanfics is the best. Probability of crush, 101%. That is on your dick. Margin of error, 1%. <laughs> well, well, well. With Dr. Alfie's helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. You sound Until like next time, darlings. That was some horrible papyrus, like, hell. Mmm. Well, that was certainly something. I love that voice. That's the voice. Wait, wait! <laughs> I love. Let me, uh, let me give you my phone number. Then, maybe if you need help, I could, uh... uh what? Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It's like a fucking Nokia! Let me just show you. You can smash it on the ground, won't even break. It doesn't even have texting! Wait a second, please. <laughs> you, could, you could get Alfie's to call Undyne, and then you could close the phone and be like the kiss. Oh my god. <laughs> Here, I upgraded it for you. Um, it, it can do texting items, and it's got a cool keychain, and I even signed you up for your Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <laughs> Mm. 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 I'm gonna go to the bathroom. <laughs> She's like... furiously masturbating. Your little feeties. Totally furiously uh, masturbating. So that's, yep. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. Or half empty. You're right. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Heck yeah. You got the instant noodles, because I'm a thief. A beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Kawaii Desu. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Huh. It seems like notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game. Or meta. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. Yeah. Oh, wow. uh, okay. <laughs> The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide, which implies that Metaton was just sitting in this wall. Just waiting. Waiting. <laughs> I can just imagine, like, Metaton going up to Alpha, it's like, wait, the human's coming. Here, trust me, we gotta. And could, just, you, like... could you, like, pave me into this wall? <laughs> <laughs> Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All of these books are labeled Human History. One. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. I too remember my American history. Same, that's the basis of American history. <laughs> VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They're not cartoons. They're all labeled human history. They aren't cartoons, they anime. they're anime. Oh my god. All these books are labeled human history. You look inside the book, it's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy packs at each other. Energy. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Top Chef sure got weird. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure that was the last episode I watched. Look inside the book. It's another comic book. A hideous android is running the school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. <laughs> Why would an android need to eat toast? I don't know. Pink goop just in the strange machine. That's a cubby custard machine. Okay. Tubby There's custard. a chainsaw? Are we just gonna ignore the chainsaw? The office's work table. She hasn't done anything in a while. Look at the anime poster. What a weeaboo. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats in a single clean dress. Take it. Put it on. Oh. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. All They're all unopened. Lovers. Stop this. <laughs> the lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. And there's no light bulb. What a weenie. Maybe you should stick the lamp in your mouth. You could light it up. What? What? <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> At first I was like, oh, that's clever, and then I was like, wait, that doesn't make any sense. You Why almost is... pulled a fast one. Why is there, like, a sideways cube here? It's an incredible invention, excuse you. She's she's hacked the game and 
entered 3D figures into the well, world. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. That's me as an artist. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. Uh, in the actual, like, the, the Undertale actual merch, this poster is a thing. It exists, and I almost bought one, but then I didn't, because I have no money. <laughs> yeah. So this has been... Where'd she go? We just don't know. She's still furiously masturbating. She just went back further because she knew we could see her feet. Yeah. Alice updated her status. I just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Ugh, sad face. Alpha's updated her status. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. But, uh, but... I feel like I've changed, like, her voice 12 times. <laughs> For now, I gotta call up on the human to guide them. Yeah. Alphys is your Ryota. Yeah. You know, that pigeon. Oh. Yeah, Vulcan! Get it? Like, it's Star Trek. Uh, Vulcan is a great god, thank you. Oh. Well, I'm gonna criticize it. <laughs> Criti Look how happy it is! I'm gonna Look, You hug have it. a hug! You give Vulcan a hug, it warms your heart. And your whole body. Ouch, your defense drops. So uh, lovey. Oh, please. Oh my god, mother, why? Okay. <laughs> that was something. Like, Vulcan's like cheeks glow with a bright heat. Yeah. Yes. Why did gold. die? Can I? I can't walk that way. <laughs> the music here is pretty rad. Gotta call him in a minute. No, you're not. What if you call her before she does? Oh, dude, wait a minute. Can I do that? No, she didn't. She you didn't can call to me. your boxes? Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can call the box. What? And it's cool because now I have two boxes. You should call Pappy Roo and Undin. You're right, I should call Pappy Roo and Undin. That's not what it... Item. <laughs> I was like, wait. Why does it keep rearranging them? Because it puts the one that you used last in the top. Ring ring, motherfucker. Oh, fuck. What was her voice? I rode on a conveyor belt once. I learned pretty fast that they make me sick. Did you hell? Yeah, like 9,000 times, it was awesome! <laughs> Thank you. That was, that was well needed. STOP CALLING AND MAKING HER SAY GROSS THINGS! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, shit, I have to go back to the lab. <laughs> I forgot something. Oh my god. Hold on! We're going on a trip! I hope you like conveyor belts! <laughs> <laughs> Going on a treasure hunt. Come on and slam. And, and welcome, welcome to, to Japan. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to Japan. You're at Alpha's lab? Is she there? Hey, tell her I said hi, okay? And, uh, tell me how she's doing. And tell me if she needs anything. And, wait, no. Don't, don't ask any of that. I love that so much. But she's fine, right? <laughs> okay, that's all you needed to do? Yeah. You got that out of your system? Because I really like them as a ship. They're my Japan. favorite lesbians.